How I started, it was very coincidentally. I was studying in Germany and I just went to a puppet to a stop motion workshop and I made my first puppet and the tutor liked it so much. He said, you have to come with us next week to Annecy. And then I came to Annecy and, and I just fell in love with the, with the media because it, it just swallowed me in. And then I did my first film and my graduation was that a puppet animation. And now this is my actually first independent film. So. Yeah, I am just following what I like to do. Of course, I admire all the big puppet masters. I admire Mackinon and Sanders, who do wonderful puppets. To tell you the truth, I'm, I'm not so into puppets. It's just really that it just follows me with the... Uh, every time I think about a, a new film, I, I hope that it's going to be a different technique. Um, and then I end up doing puppets. I uh, decided to, to start on my own with the production. Um, if that was smart or not, I don't know, but at the beginning it was quite impossible to get funding in Slovenia because if you haven't produced a, a film as a producer, you have zero points and with zero points you can't get really a project. But I was very against, uh, I mean, I didn't know much of the producers here. I heard bad stories afterwards. I saw they are very nice people. But um, on the end, I still know that they would never have patience to work with me because they, they don't know what animation is and how much time is, is needed to, to do something. I was lucky to have a German film, so I could produce my first film, uh, which I did then with Marina Rousset together. Um, this was just a two minute uh, little experiment, but still I got the budget from there and that was my first film and then I could got already the points in the film funding and that's how I, I could start with my own firm. My favorite films are all based on some kind of a literature and uh, I just then read many, many stories. I never think of the continuity. I think if you do it from your heart, it's probably what's your signature if you don't try to, I don't know, copy something or try to do something which will be lovable for the public. I always try to take something that bothers me out of... of um, and until now that was uh, mostly uh, love trouble. Um, so I don't know. I hopefully it doesn't go into the dark corners anymore. But actually, my next film it's gonna be dark. <laughs> Within Animateka, uh, Slovenians do know that there are different uh, uh, animations than cartoons for kids, and um, I mean, thank God for that. And I hope, I hope, I hope Animateka is gonna be with us for decades. <laughs>